Carter, staff writer for The Prowler, sitting down with Coach Everett. Thank you for coming. You're welcome. All right. So how do you, as the coach, go about setting the lineup? Does it change match to match, or does it pretty much have a set all season? Um, it depends on who we're playing. When we play our region matches, which are the ones that really count going into the tournament, um, we do try to play our strongest lineup so we can make sure that we win those matches. Um, so we do have certain players that have kind of earned their positions in singles and in doubles. But if we're playing a weaker team, sometimes I like to try to get the other players in and give those a break just so that everybody gets a chance to play and improve and show their skills. Great. And how do your captains of the girls and boys show leadership and help some of the new players? Um, I have great captains, actually. Um, we have two boy captains, and they've been on the team for five years because they started as eighth graders. Um, so they kind of know the ropes of how the tennis team works. So not only do they lead in ability, they're two of my starters, but they also kind of show the kids how to improve their skills and kind of how to act with their attitude on the court as well. Same for the girls. I've got three senior girls that share the responsibility of captains. And they do the same thing. They help with improving the other teammates' skills and helping them with their attitude on the courts. And how is the connection between the team as a whole with communication and supporting each other? It's really good. It's a small team. Um, we're kind of a young team, and, but they all get along well. Um, they all um, communicate. We use a group me just to share lineups and information about matches. But as far as um, getting together as a team, they've had several team dinners. They like to get together and socialize and do fun stuff. But they cheer each other on at the matches, too. Even if they're not in the lineup, they come to the matches and they support their teammates. Oh, wow. And we all know how important region games are. Is there anything special y'all are working on to prepare? Um, we're playing our last week of region games this week in the regular season. We'll have a couple of practice matches next week, and then our region matches for the region tournament will be right after spring break. So the whole season's kind of been in preparation for that tournament. But each match we have, we kind of learn where we have strengths, where we have weaknesses, and where we might need to move things around or improve our skills. And... Being this far in the season, what are your biggest strengths and weaknesses? Um, biggest strengths, we've got great players with great attitudes. They give good effort on the court, um, but we're not a real deep team. We have some really good players that play tournament ball outside of high school tennis, and that helps us a lot, but we have a lot of new players too that um, are trying to learn the game and get better at their skills. So. It kind of drops off after a little bit. We have some strong players and then some weaker players, so we're trying to get better as a team overall. Great. All right. Thank you so much for coming, Coach. You're welcome. Thanks for watching. I'm Abby Carter, and go check out theprowlernews.org.